on y'all um me zeke here gonna do a video on my fly rod setup here okay so um fly rod fly fishing setup so i have a for my case i have a don't want to pronounce this wrong but um plano yeah plano guide series um, yeah plano guide series so um yeah, you can't really see me, but I'll fix that. So, um, in my usual filming spot. Okay, so, I haven't tried this, but if you ask me, it would work. So, I was like, I, do you, I asked this guy, do you have a non-tapering leader? He's like, no, but I've you tried, you, I just use fishing line. So, I got, uh, right, yeah, that eight pound test. I'm going to try that eventually when I need a new leader for my leader. So, um, is, hold on, uh, focus, okay, uh, those are my flies, um, my other flies, um, uh, saw a guy fly fish with the Senko. I don't know if it'll work or not. I thought about trying. I haven't had the time. Been testing out my own flies. And um, if y'all wish to buy any kinds of my flies, y'all can go to my other video. Um, it's called All My Flies That Are For Sale. You just click on, yeah. Y'all know how to do that. So click on my channel. Go there. Look at it, you know. Um, I got some nice flies. Um, my dad won't stop saying that my flies look like something that you'll buy out of Bass Pro and they do look pretty good not to be you know yeah I'll just say that they look pretty dang good I've caught fish on them and some of them I invent I invented it yeah um no. I was hoping that maybe that'd have been the UPS truck bringing my fishing mask there yeah I'm getting some um I ordered some fishing masks off of Salt Armor um, Company. Um, they had this crazy deal going on where um, buy one mask, get two free. Yeah, two. Um, so I got the Mako Shark, the um, Redfish, and the uh, um, Tarpon. Because those are all fish that I want to catch on a fly rod. And I ain't going to be doing it on this flimsy thing either. So, yeah. Okay, um... This is my fly rod setup. This is my fly rod. I'm almost aware that it's an eight foot six. Um, it is a shakes. Hold on, shakes. Wait, yeah, Shakespeare. Catch more fish. Hopefully, y'all can see that. I'm sorry if you can't. But um, the rod that it came, the not the rod, but the reel that it came with was pretty much a piece of crap. Well, I mean, it worked, um, but, and then so my dad had an old Caddis Creek, throw that on there. Yeah, I love it. Um, I'm using, I don't even know. I'm using pretty much everything that it came with except the reel. Um, except this leader. I had this leader. Yeah, you can't really see leaders, you know, that's the purpose. And right now, I got on the shiny booger for my fly. Um. So, yeah, but, uh, mm -hmm. show you all my casts. I'm getting fairly good, hopefully. Don't want to get caught in this tree, but if I do, I'll teach you all how to get, how I get my flies out of trees. Yeah. There we go. I think I'll just get it caught in the tree on purpose, so I'm going to show you all. Okay, yeah. Uh, as you hear, get your camera here. Okay, so as, okay, hold on. Let me. So, as you see, my fly rod is suspended and it is caught up in that tree right there. So, what we're going to do here, how I always get mine down, is I. Uh, 
Put my rod down. I want to leave my rod. Hold on. Leave the rod out of the story. Because you would much rather. I'd much rather have my fly line. Oh, wait. Wait. I'd much rather have my fly line break or lose my fly or something than, you know, my whole rod snap. Yeah. So, you just want to pull on it. Boom. That's it. Just pull on it. Give it some tugs. On your first one, just give it one nice swift tug. That's what I like to do. Um, and it usually pops it out there unless you got it caught and wrapped around the branch. Then that's going to require some weight. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm having my camera a different way and everything. So, yeah. Oh my gosh. I don't even know how I had it caught. Okay. That's right there. So, again, um, let me get in a shady spot so I can kind of show y'all what all flies I got here with me. I'm going to get over here right quick. Okay, so, this is my... Okay. That's one side of my fly box. This is the other. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> yeah. Figured I'd show y'all that. Uh. Y'all got any tips, tricks, things that I'm doing wrong? Um, I'd love to have them. I'm not going to get mad at you for saying, Oh, you're doing this wrong. You're doing this wrong. Sorry y'all can't see my face. Just out in a sunny spot. Um. Sunny today. So. Be a nice day to go out fishing on the lake in a kayak or something dive in first where the fish aren't at and then jump in jump in get wet and then go fish that's what I do right now so um but yeah anyways I just found out that we're going to the beach okay so not this weekend this weekend I'm going to a PBR bull riding event so go get go meet JB Mooney you know Silvano guys like them then the next weekend after that I got a rodeo then that next weekend after that I'll have I'll be here at my mom's house so yeah this is my mom's house oh hold on sorry I'm so sorry about this guys my mom's house right there um we're hopefully moving in a year or two we'll move out in Walkertown get us some land and stuff so yeah but I'm not gonna tell you where I'm at that's kind of creepy and so yeah but um and we're gonna go to the beach i may take my fly rod here and if i can find a spot like i don't even know how to what to call it, just a nice area um flat area no waves y'all are saying i'm stupid i know i'd like to take it you know throw out some of my flies and see if i could catch a small little um croaker or something and i'd like to try and see, say that i caught a saltwater fish on a fly rod but if y'all have any suggestions please please tell me i know redfish like to hit bronze stuff and brown or yeah i think it's a lot of bronze stuff so um but if they like yeah if y'all got any suggestions on what to use please tell me in the comments below um yeah i would love that so cause i don't want to catch a redfish on there and break my fly rod and i know that probably break my fly line so and break all my stuff so but um if you got any suggestions any please tell me um i'll put my email in the description box below if you would like to buy any of my flies you can look at them in my other video Ah, oh, stupid mosquito. I need to learn how to tie my mosquito flies. I love using those things. Um, but yeah, I would love to hear your advice. Um, tell me how you like my videos. Share. Tell your friends about them. Because, you know, yeah. But thank y'all for watching these videos. Bye.